Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brittany. And if this is your first time stumbling across one of my videos, I focus on fashion, beauty, luxury, lifestyle, fragrances, and pretty much whatever else I feel like talking about. So if that seems like something that you may be interested in, please think about clicking on that subscribe button if you enjoy the content, of course. Also, if you're already a subscriber, go ahead and click on that notification bell. I tend to upload once or twice a week on Sundays and Thursdays, so I don't want you to miss anything. Today's video is going to be all about updating your fall wardrobe. I've picked up a few pieces that I'm absolutely in love with from Express. So if you guys are interested in seeing what I got and how I style them up, then stick around. Okay, y'all. So we're going to start off with tops and we're going to talk about this top that I'm wearing today. Oh my goodness. I love this top so much. You guys, this is an olive green bodysuit. As you can see, it has a beautiful cutout here. So it shows a little bit of cleavage, which is perfect for the fall when you're really covered up and you just want to show a little bit of sex appeal with just some jeans, boots, and maybe a leather jacket on top. This is from the Body Contour Collection. You guys, I've ranted and raved about this collection for at least five videos now. You absolutely need a piece from this collection. And when I saw that they came out with this, which was a little bit different than the other tops that I have, perfect for the fall. I love a good mock neck. I love, like I said, the keyhole detailing, and this is a bodysuit, so you don't have to worry about it coming out of your jeans when you sit down or anything like that. Love this so much. I always get a size large in the body contour um, pieces and I find that they fit me really well. So when I style this up, I would probably do this with just like I said, some jeans, a leather jacket and boots. Um, you really can't go wrong, but you can do a lot with this. It's perfect for date night. Okay y'all, so here is the olive bodysuit on. I absolutely love it. I love this sheen that it has because again, it just elevates the look a lot. Love the keyhole detailing, shows a little bit of cleavage and let me come closer so you guys can kind of see the material here super soft it feels amazing like butter on the skin so I decided to just pair this with some skinny jeans with a little bit of distressing that I have from Express um, and these are still available I will definitely link these for you guys but I've had these for a little minute but I wanted to make this a little bit more casual for maybe like a day date when it's a little bit brisk outside but not too cold right so I really like how this looks I added a nice pair of platforms but my feet are still out but because they are platforms and a little thicker it still gives like fall vibes so I added this really cute croc faux leather jacket which is really really nice you guys love this it adds a little bit of edge to the look it also has shoulder padding in there so it's going to give you a little bit more structure and from my accessories I'm going to add an olive green handbag which is quite casual in my opinion and I have some olive green shades here so adding these and girl we are ready for a cute little fall day date what do you think i love this look So my next top is another off the shoulder top, but this one is more of a cropped top. Um, you can wear this dressed up or dressed down. And I like the fact that it is two toned. So the top part, as you can see, is cream. And then the bottom part is black. So you can really dress this up if you want to. Um, knowing me, I'd probably just wear some black jeans or maybe some black leather pants or something. But you can always add like a pencil skirt. I think that would be really nice. Um, let's say if you're going to like a work function for the holidays, I think that would be really nice to wear um, because it's kind of elegant, even though it does show a little bit of the shoulder, it doesn't show too much cleavage. So it's really, really, really nice. And I love the fact that this is satin. So it really does elevate the look. And when I got this, it only came in the two-tone color, but now on the website, they have it in all black, which you guys know, that would be my first choice. But I do like that this one is different for me um, with the cream detailing on top. And I did pick this up in a size extra large. It does have a little bit of a stretch panel in the back. So that really does help if you have a larger bust like myself. Okay, y'all. So let's get into the jeans that I picked up. Now, these are a solid black wide leg pair of jeans and y'all I don't have a pair of solid black 
jeans like no distressing no cutouts no nothing right and these are wide legs so they do elevate your look um and it's just perfect i think you absolutely need a pair of these jeans for the fall again i got these in a size 14 short they are perfect length on me and i like the fact that they skim over my heels as well i love when wide leg jeans just kind of show the point of a pump or something like that and even though i did get them in the short length they still are like a really really good length because sometimes when you get them in short they can be a little too short but these are absolutely perfect y'all these jeans are so comfortable and they are high-waisted as well they look so good on but of course you guys will see me style them up okay y'all so I decided to pair the satin off the shoulder top with these wide leg black jeans I think this is perfect for like a dinner date or something like that super cute right now I'm wearing this top more like a corset you can absolutely tuck this in but I pulled it on the outside just to give a little bit more shape and I'm really liking that. Let me come closer so you guys can kind of see what it's looking like. Absolutely loving this top. And this is what the top looks like in the back. You can see it does have a little bit of ruched detailing just for a little added um, elasticity and comfort. So really loving this top so much. I paired it with some um, old like black and gold earrings. Like I said, I do have on the wide leg jeans. These are in a size 14 short and they fit perfectly. I just added some um, barely there sandals. You can't really see my feet and I like that, but you can also do a pair of pointed toe boots or pointed toe black pumps. I think that would be really nice. And for my bag, I'm going to add a little bit of texture with a patent leather bag this time. So still black, but you know, it's patent. So it's a little bit more dressy. And I think this look is really cute. Like I said, perfect for dinner or a date night or something like that. And you look elegant but you're not showing too much, but it's very sexy because you're showing off the decollete, the shoulder area. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about this. You can also add like a really uh, nice statement piece necklace. I decided to do earrings just because I'm more of an earring girl, but yeah, really love 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 both of these pieces and I think you guys will love them too. Okay y'all so I did pick up one dress this time and when I saw this I knew I had to have it because I'm definitely having an olive green moment right now and this dress is just so nice. It is a mock neck strong shouldered long sleeve dress. It is a mini and it has ruched detailing so it's super flattering. I thought that this would be perfect for the fall. Not only the color but the style and it's very sexy as well. Um, you can wear it to work maybe if you would do a longer black blazer I would say um, but date night this will be really cute or maybe going to a concert or something like that you can wear it with some knee-high boots I mean y'all it's just really 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 cute it also comes in black as well and it was really hard for me not to get both but um, I did have to pick up the green now I have read reviews since I've received mine stating that it is hard to get this on over your head so we're gonna try it on and we're gonna see I'll give you my thoughts when I try it on though but absolutely love this dress the color is so perfect for fall and it's just it's chef's kiss y'all okay y'all so I okay y'all so I have on the shoulder padded dress now listen <laughs> it was a task getting this on I do have to agree with the um reviews on this and I got this in a size large so I do recommend you sizing up um just to get it over your head and plus like if you have makeup on it's gonna be a struggle. You're definitely gonna wanna put like a bag or something over your head to get this on um, if you decide to put this on after you are done with all your glam. But this is the dress. I do like the dress. It has ruched detailing here. And I like this little piece coming over here. So it just gives a little bit of interest. It's long sleeves, as you guys can see. It is a different material than the olive green top that I showed you guys earlier, but on camera, it does look a lot more shinier um, than it actually is in person. But yeah, this is what the size large looks like on me, okay? I would definitely go for an extra large in this. Um, so I did keep the tags on because I'm probably going to uh, return it. Um, but yeah, I do love it. I think it's very sexy. It looks very flattering on the body. Let me know what you guys think about it. Love the shoulder pad detailing because it gives some structure to the body as well. And it just balances you out, especially if you have wider hips or larger thighs. Now, how I would style this up is pretty simply. Um, I just added a pair of suede black boots. Now, Express has a gorgeous pair of croc boots on their website. 
website that I'll link down below. I really want to get my hands on those because they look so luxe and shiny. But these are what I could get to right at the moment. And I do like the gold detailing on these. I also added just a pair of gold earrings and I would add this black and gold larger bag. For fall, I do like to pull out my larger handbag. So I think this is something you could wear to work if you wanted to. And also if it gets a little bit too cold or if you feel like a bodycon is inappropriate for work, you can always throw a blazer on top and I have one here. Now, when you are throwing a blazer on this, keep in mind the dress already has shoulder pads. So you may be doing double doses with the shoulder pad detailing, but I do like the fact that this leather blazer adds some texture to it. And I like that it's a little bit of a longer line. So this is really nice if you needed to add something, but I probably wouldn't. I would just probably leave it as is and just wear the dress because I like the silhouette of it. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about this. Okay, y'all, so we're down to our last couple of pieces and they are jackets. Now this first jacket is more of a shirt jacket jacket. Um, and you guys know jackets were really on trend a couple years ago, but I'm still not over it, okay? I really love a shirt jacket for this time of year because it is not too cold. So you don't always wanna throw on a jacket that you feel like you have to take off. This is like the perfect one that you can leave on and not be too high. So it's so perfect, but it like keeps the chill off of you. So you cannot have fall without a hound's tooth piece. Okay, listen, I'm just the messenger here. You cannot have fall without a hound's tooth piece, hound's tooth piece in your wardrobe. So this jacket is hound's tooth, of course, and you can do so much with this. Now, I love a hound's tooth piece because to me, it automatically gives like that gossip girl vibe, just that like really um, girly kind of preppy vibe and it's just really really cute very glam so you can always edge this up if you want to with like leather but still glam it up as well with maybe some like um, studs you know like some really sparkly studs or maybe a cute hat so many options with the hound's tooth y'all I live for a hound's tooth piece every time I wear my hound's tooth I just feel like clueless or, you know, like I said, gossip girl or something like that. So it's really, really cute. Um, I would pair this simply just all black underneath, but you can wear this with uh, jeans as well. Maybe even a skirt. I think a leather skirt would be really cute with this. Maybe some combat boots um, and just a black, maybe mock neck turtleneck or something like that. Or you can do a black dress underneath here, put that um, hound's tooth on top and then some combat boots or some knee high boots with a heel. So many different options you guys or dress it down you can do sneakers with it jeans I just live for a house tooth moment Let okay y'all so my ponytail has gone through it from trying on that dress but this is my last piece and this is okay y'all so my ponytail has gone through it from trying on that dress but we are here nonetheless um okay that rhymed bars but anyway this is the hound's tooth shacket let me know what you guys think now i did get this in a size large because it says that it was oversized but i do wish i would have gotten this in an extra large don't get me wrong it fits i can button it and everything but i would have preferred a little bit more of an oversized fit now i was not expecting for it to be um as long lined as it is so it is pretty long i kind of like my jackets a little shorter but i decided to pair this very 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 chill i have on a pair of faux leather leggings and i also have on just one of the body contour uh tank tops underneath and i threw this on top with some combat boots so very chill very simple silver accessories and, and i'll probably just pair it with this uh patent leather shoulder bag so throwing this over the shoulder and you're good to go for errands on a saturday a cute little maybe bar date or something like that going to get coffee on a saturday you know something very chill so i do like this i feel very cozy it's perfect for days like today when it's like 46 degrees and you're going to be like in and out you know so you don't have to lug a heavy coat with you everywhere you go you can just throw this on and it does have a little bit of weight to it it is not lined though that's one thing it's not lined but it's very cute and yeah this is what it looks like kind of like that tweed material so it looks very luxe absolutely loving this let me know what y'all think now just like you can't have fall without a hound's tooth piece you absolutely cannot have fall without 
a leather jacket. In this case, I picked up a croc moto jacket. Y'all, I don't have any like croc faux leather pieces in my wardrobe. So that's why I opted to get this. And I thought it was really, really nice. It also doesn't have any colored hardware. I like the fact that the hardware on this is black as well. So it's very minimalistic, but it has that texture that can really add a richness to your look. And it can just amp it up. Even if you're wearing all black, like leggings, combat boots, um, a turtleneck, and you throw this on you're adding texture edge a little bit of glam and you just need your accessories to do all the talking but this is a really nice jacket y'all i love the belt that it comes with just really really cute so many options with this and like i said i didn't have a croc piece in my wardrobe so i thought that this would be nice to add for that edgy glam look but with a little bit of texture as well. And I picked this up in a size extra large. It does have like a little bit of an oversized fit, but not too oversized. So I like this a lot. You can definitely size down in this if you want it to be a little bit more fitted, but I like the way the extra large is fitting. So yeah, super, super, super cute. All right, y'all. So that is the end of my Express haul. Thank you so much Express for sponsoring today's video. I hope you guys were able to pull some ideas from this video and also realize that you can really update and elevate your fall wardrobe really simply with just solid pieces and really good quality pieces that won't break the bank as well. So I will have everything listed down below in the description box for you guys along with the size that I chose in each item and it will be super easy for you all to shop and you'll have that as a reference. So thank you guys again for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you want more fall content and I will talk to you on my next one. Bye y'all.